So here we are folks with match number 17. It's Russia, the hosts up against Egypt. So a quick a rundown of the Russian side. Akin Pen with goal to Sinkia, Kombarov, Smolinkov, Kudasharov, Zatzakov, Tsurkov, Miranchuk, Samadov, Zugba, and Smolov. As for Egypt, Ekrami in goal, Gerber, Fati, Elhamadi, Hegazi, Aysala, Said, Sabiri, Warda, Mawson, and Mo Salah up front. So here we are, folks, with the match just about to get underway. Match number 17, Russia against Egypt. And Russia get the match underway in the traditional white jerseys up against a familiar Egypt in their red and white. Now, if you are going to watch this game in the real world, it will take place on the 19th of June at the Kurovsky Stadium. And that's in St. Petersburg. Not sure what to expect from both Egypt and Russia in this group. In fact, this group is pretty, it's pretty tight. Um, obviously, the likes of Mo Salah has been on sensational form in the real world for Liverpool. Can he find his feet here in 16-bit as we've hacked FIFA 95, the classic football uh, game from, from way back when. Uh, used to play on the old Sega Mega Drive. AKA the Genesis if you're from the States. Yeah, we've managed to uh, to kind of bend the rules a little bit of this game to try and uh, in bring the teams up to the present day 2018 standards. Obviously the World Cup squads have yet to be announced. So this is just a, a, a little bit of a guess at who's gonna be featuring. And here we go, Russia with a quick shot. Down to the ground, the Egypt keeper keeps this game at nil-nil. Booted out. Now maybe Egypt can build something. Lovely ball there. Floated pass. And that pass is horrific and it goes out of play for a throw for Russia. Now when this video goes live, we will be still still a good maybe maybe six weeks away from the World Cup. Maybe two my oh my goodness, I've stopped in my words. They choked on my words there as Egypt get the noses in front here. Who's on the score sheet? Can't really tell right now, but uh, it's Mo well, I don't know what his first name is, Mosin. Mosin's his surname for Egypt. Banging them in front, the Pharaohs. Get their heads in the lead. Now Russia, the hosts, need to get themselves back in this. If they really want to, you know, continue uh, in the tournament. Because they want to, you know, this group is still pretty, pretty close. I think Saudi Arabia got a chance. Uruguay not out of it, obviously. They still got two games yet to play. So, I think a defeat might give them a bit of, a bit of problems. But that's a good effort to come try and get back into it. Russia with a snapshot there. Yeah, there is no way to uh, indicate who, which player is who on a CPU versus CPU basis. So uh, your guess is as good as mine. Uh, who's got the balls? That's, that's a little feature that, that does frustrate me a little bit. But hey, we are playing FIFA 95. Love this game, love this game. Now these two sides have not met in the real world, so this will be the first time Egypt has taken on Russia. Now if this is your first time that you've ever seen one of my FIFA 95 games, uh, I want to let you know that we do play two four minute halves. And we are just eking into the last minute of this first half. Egypt with that only goal motion. Great strike. Throw in. Not really amounted to much. Russia on the defensive here. And they just put it out for another throw. And Egypt still build now. Looking for a second goal, which would really give them a good, good platform. Maybe to get out of this group. Punted long. Look for a second. Oh, that's a good effort. 
effort as we creep and crawl towards the four minute mark. Booted. Still kept alive. Egypt looking for that again, that second goal, which will probably put them out of sight. Oh, and they, they're making it work. They're making that confirmative of work between the sticks. As we're just about done. We have done the four minutes allocation. So whatever the referee allows will be the lot. Russia not really in this, and that is the first half. So Egypt will kick us off in the second half. Here we are at the Kruskovsky Stadium, St. Petersburg. It looks pretty much just like any other stadium in Russia. In 16-bit. So if you are going to be watching these FIFA 95 uh, versions of the 2018 World Cup, let me know your predictions in the, in the comment section below. As Russia tries to get themselves back in this game. It's only 1-0 down. They're still in it. They're still got hope. But time is of the essence. Let me know who, who you think is going to win the World Cup. Who you think is going to be the dark horses in the surprise package. And also, while I got your attention, as we wait for the next major highlight, make sure you hit that subscribe button because there's plenty of World Cup action. I'm working on an amazing project right now that seems to be coming together. Um, and if it does, it will be immense. So hit that subscribe button and then you'll know you'll be updated with any developments over the next few weeks. Russia in midfield now. Trying to eke their way into this game. One goal. A, point, a share of the points would be good. And that shot is takes a deflection off of the Egypt uh, defender. He just puts it out for a corner. No, no mucking about there. Just wants rid. Russia with the corner now. 16-bit style -y. Headed in. Oh, over the top. In the next match for these two sides, Uruguay will be taking on the hosts, Russia, and Egypt will wrap up their group campaign up against Saudi Arabia. Squeezed in the lovely pass. Through ball, puts a shot. I can film up down to the ground. Russia still probing. Lovely pass through ball. Can he get onto it? He's got a lot of work to do. Great strike. Good save even by the Egypt keeper. Goes out for another corner. Can they make it count? Floated in there. And just put behind once again by Egypt. Ain't mucking about third corner now for Russia. Floated. Headed in. Oh, keeper. Keeper collects it. Calm and composed in the end. Down to the last 90 seconds of the match. And right now, Egypt are in cruise control. Good ball, nice. Broken up though by Egypt. Headed out. It's, it's one of them frustrating afternoons for Russia. They don't know if they can find their way through. They're down to the last maybe minute or so to get something from this. A draw would keep them in it. I'm not sure if a defeat is completely a lost cause, but it'll make it an uphill struggle, and they'll probably have to rely on other results to go their way. Obviously, there is another game at this level. Oh my goodness, what a strike and what a goal. Great effort by the keeper. And the crowd goes uh, uncomfortably silent. But that strike hits the fingers of the keeper and just rolls over the line. But I'm sure they'll take it anyway. Small off with the goal. And Russia are back in this now. 1-1. One, one. And now I think they've got, a, they've got a decent chance to get through. But still a lot of football to be played. We're only at the halfway stage of this group. Obviously Uruguay will be taking on Saudi Arabia in the next match in this group. Is, is there time for a heartbreaker from either side? Right now it does look like Russia are the, uh, the team on top. We're down to the last 30 seconds. Floated in there. And headed out. And Russia will probably take their time on this. I think they'll be happy with the point. 
considering the situation they were in at the uh, first half. But they're probing. They're probing. Oh, and that nearly squeezed through into the, into the back of the net. But it looks like Egypt are going to hold on for a point as well. So, all in all, not a, not a bad result for both sides. But qualification nowhere near secured. It's Egypt with the last bit of attacking play. And not a bad effort as well. Goes wide. Akin Fanweb was equal to it. And they are now past, well, deep, deep, deep into injury time. And that is your lot. Russia won, Egypt won. And a quick look at the statistics here. Look at that. Six, uh, eight shots for Russia, six saves by Egypt. Uh, three corner kicks for Russia. As for the goal scorers, Mosin got us underway with the goal for Egypt. And Smolov wrapped it up at the seven minutes, 15 seconds equalizer. No players were in the in no no players got yellow cards so clean game. And after that result, here's an updated look at the table. Thanks again for watching. Please like, share, and of course subscribe. Check back each and every day for some hot World Cup content.